What's up guys, and we're back to my channel. So last time we did how to run out your full potential part one. That was the A skips, how you, the rising action where you lift your foot. It's like a skip. And um, today we're gonna be doing uh, part B, where it's the clawing action like this. You claw down. Um, so this is what it looks like, and um, let's get ready. And But you might be asking yourself, your running's easy, man. You just put one foot forward, then your next foot forward, then your next foot forward. You just run, right? But there's more to it. So we did part A last time. Let's do part B now. So part B will look like this. We're back to my beautiful backyard. And, um, hmm. Okay, that's good. So, um, the last time I did a skip, Chest goes in, comes back out, goes back in, comes back out. You do, do this, go this, claw out, and the chest comes up. And this is the second part, it's called B skips. The hands are up high, you just howling at your throat. That's what you want to do. Don't forget. Do not do this. I think people will tell you, run with your physical. That's going to take up a lot of energy. Run with your hands free, kind of straight. You keep on near yourself. You go like this, there's a lot of air resistance going on. You go like this, there's little air resistance going on. Then you go like this. And if you have trouble going this right away, you should do this. Five base skips. One, two, three. Go claw. One, two, three, claw. One, two, three, claw. And so, and that's how you do B skips. And I hope that made it easier, but I know it didn't. <laughs> so stay tuned for part three and four, and we'll see you next time. Peace.